Hi reception. I hope you're well. Welcome to your English video for today. Now, We've been learning all about Sue Potato, finding out about Evil P and the kinds of mischief he gets up to. Now, I've found a new story all about Sue Potato and a new adventure to share with you. Would you like to hear it? Fabulous. OK, listen carefully to the story because afterwards we're going to do some activities with it. And I want you to be able to remember what happened and in what order in particular. OK, let's get started. So the story is called Sue Potato. Veggies in the Valley of Doom. Oh, look, some of our favourite characters are there. Can you see some you already know? <laughs> oh, I wonder why he's wearing some oven gloves. Maybe we'll find out soon. OK, can you see? It was night time in the supermarket. And the veggies were complaining. Oh, there's nothing to do, whined Pineapple. We could play hide and seek, said Broccoli. I'm great at hide and seek. Oh, what a splendid idea, said Sue Potato. So the veggies ran off to hide and Sue Potato started to count. One, two, three. 498, 499, 500! Ready or not, here I come. Hmm, they must be around here somewhere, thought Sue Potato. Can you spot any? I can see a few. Is that you, Tomato? I can see. See you, pineapple, and you, cucumber. I think I've found you, carrot. You found me, said carrot, but look what I've found. Oh, look, what do you think Super Carrot has found? Well, shall we find out? Oh, <gasps> it's a treasure map. Oh, you might be right, said Sue Potato, and it seems to be leading to the gardening aisle. As the veggies gathered round, someone was watching them. Ooh, treasure, thought the evil pea from his hiding place. Come on, let's go, shouted the veggies. Not so far, said Sue Potato. First, we're going to need some supplies. Hmm, I wonder what you would take if you went on a treasure hunt. Why don't you pause the video and tell your helper what you think you would need? Some fabulous ideas reception. Let's see what happens next in the story. And he rounded up some water, biscuits, rope, and of course, a pair of oven gloves. Huh? But the entrance to the gardening aisle was a wall of plants. We'll never get through that, said Carrot. Ah, said Sue Potato, that's what the water is for. And with that, he poured it onto the pots. <laughs> Went the plants as they all sprang up, clearing the way ahead. Thanks, Sue Potato, we were gasping. Wow, said Tomato, I didn't know plants could talk. Come on, everyone, said Carrot. The map says we need to go through the Valley of Doom. <gasps> Reception, why would it be called the Valley of Doom? What do you think? Why don't you tell your helper? Oh, it does sound like a scary place. I wonder if there's lots of dangerous things in the Valley of Doom. I think we're going to find out. Hmm, why is it called the Valley of Doom? Wondered Pineapple. And look, I can see some scary eyes spying on the vegetables. But he didn't wonder for long. Quick, Pineapple, it's crunch time, shouted Sue Potato. Throw me the biscuits. Luckily, the biscuits did the trick, and Sue Potato and the veggies were soon out of danger. Phew, they fed biscuits to the plants. But now they'd reached a dead end. This must be Cactus Canyon, said Carrot. We'll get prickled to pieces, cried Tomato. How will we ever get through? With oven gloves, of course, said Sue Potato. 
and soon they were back on their way. It was a long trek through the desert. I can't go on, said Tomato. Yes, you can, said Sue Potato. Together, we're all going to make it. Wow, isn't he kind, helping his friends and encouraging them. That's what we like to do in reception class, isn't it? Encourage each other. After hours of walking, they were finally out of the desert. Oh, I can see a treasure chest, shouted Carrot. We're almost there. But Sue Potato and the veggies were so excited they didn't see. What do you think they didn't see, reception? I think so. Shall I have a peek? Oh, I didn't guess this. They didn't see the quicksand. Help, help, they yelled. We're sinking fast. <laughs> Shrieked the evil pea. You are in a sticky situation. Oh dear, said one of the cactuses to another. Is this the end of Sue Potato and the veggies? Maybe it was. With Sue Potato in the quicksand, who could help the veggies in distress? What do you think? Who could help? Shall we find out? Well, don't look at me, shouted the pea. The treasure's mine, all mine. Please, please help us, called the veggies. Before it's too late. Oh, all right, snapped the pea, if I must. Evil P to the rescue. <gasps> He's not so bad after all. Sue Potato threw the rope and the P pulled them to safety. You saved us, squealed the veggies. You're a hero. No, I'm not. I'm evil. All that help, help, help was giving me a headache. That's all. Sue Potato smiled. The moment had come. Everyone crowded around the treasure chest. It was time to see what was inside. And look, Evil P is waiting on top. What do you think is going to be inside? Oh, wouldn't that be exciting? I wonder if you're right. Let's see. What a surprise. Surprise, yelled Broccoli, popping out of the treasure chest. I told you I was great at hide and seek. Broccoli was the treasure. Sue Potato and the gang started the long walk home. I didn't have you down as one of the good guys, P, said Sue Potato, but maybe I was wrong. <laughs> Whatever you say, Sue Potato, sniggered the P. If you look closely, evil P is still causing trouble and he's written on the back of his, of his cape, Pooh Potato. <laughs> oh, evil P. I don't think he's as evil as he likes to think he is. I think he's got... I think he's got a good side too. That's the end of our story.